Ten things it would be hard to live without. You just don't want to live with it. You just don't want to be without them in your life. And the first thing I believe that would be hard to live without is that you don't want to live without Jesus in your life, especially if you want your soul to be saved before you die. You don't want to live without that. And the second thing I believe would be hard to live without is uh, live without having any prayer life. I don't believe you want to live without that. I believe you want to have a prayer life. I'm not so sure about you, but I got to have a prayer life. And the third thing I believe would be hard to live without is um, having people's help. You got to have people's help in your life. You can't live without that. You got to have some people's help somewhere in your life to be able to help you. And I believe the fourth thing I believe would be hard to live without is uh, any money. If you ain't got any money, you're just flat broke. You don't have any money at all. You're just in bad shape. You know, you, hard to live without that. You know, you'd be really down and out if you, if you don't have any money. And I believe the fifth thing to be hard to live without is to uh, live without any good health in your life or having a way to keep your health in good standing or have some adequate equipment to work out with. I believe you have to have that, you know, and you don't want to live without it. And the sixth thing I believe it would be hard to live without is to not have very much com communication in your life. You won't have enough communication in your life. You won't have enough communication in your life you don't have a good social life. It's, it'd be hard to live without it. I mean, you know, some people are shut in, like some of these people in the nursing homes are shut in, or, or they're in jail or whatever, and they, they can't get out, or or they live way out in the country somewhere, and they can't get out much. It'd be pretty rough. I mean, I guess you can get on the telephone or whatever and, you know, t talk that way, but you really need some personal one-on-one -on -one interaction with people. You really need that. And the seventh thing I believe to be hard to live without would be uh, hard to live without enough people caring about you. You know, you want some people caring about your life. You don't want to get to the point. It's pretty rough for homeless people because I don't imagine there's too many people care about homeless people. I would imagine. But you won't have enough people caring about you to have a reason to live. I mean, you want to live, you want to live for the Lord, but, you know, it won't enough people caring about you, so it'd be hard to live without that. And I believe the eighth thing, it would be hard to live without hard hard to be hard to live without a good supply of clean water. You got to have some clean water to be able to make it. I mean, you don't want to be drinking any dirty water like some of these people in these third world countries. They they have a hard time getting any really half decent water, but. If you live in a good country, just be thankful you can get you some good water. Because it'd be hard to live without it. And I believe the ninth thing it'd be hard to live without is uh be able to get the proper nutritious food. You know, you want to be able to get the proper food, be able to you know, be able to stay healthy, so it'll be hard to live without that. Keep you know, keep your body healthy and all. And the tenth and final thing that I believe it would be hard to live without is that hard to be living without the proper bed to sleep on. You don't want to have something good to sleep on, you know, you don't want to be sleeping on a ground or whatever and be some terrible sleeping. So you gotta you got you gotta get you plenty plenty of good rest there if you can. Not everybody can. They have aches and pains and they can't have a hard time going to sleep. So but you want to have you get you some good sleep, so it'd be hard to live without some good sleep. You know, you, you won't be living very well if you do. And that, my friends, are ten, ten things I believe that would be hard to live without. And I appreciate you joining me for the video. And glad you